Okay, let's move on to gateway address. There are several different ways that you can refer to your router. You can call it your home network router, you can call it your wireless access point or WAP, or a term I like is residential gateway. So basically what it is, is it's a device that's in a home or a residence that's sort of a gateway to the internet. So basically what a gateway address is, is the IP address on your home wireless router. That is your gateway address. That is your home network's gateway to the internet. Now I'm not going to just leave it at that. Let's look into this just a little bit deeper to get a better understanding of how networks work. You'll remember earlier we were talking about how IP addresses are grouped according to what network they belong on. I said that if one IP address is on one network and another IP address belongs to another network, those two IP addresses cannot communicate without the help of some sort of a router or switch. Obviously, you're not sitting around spending all your time on one computer communicating back and forth to other computers on just your network. You're trying to communicate with other computers on the internet. So when your computer sends a packet, remember that word, off to a computer that's not on your network, but is on the internet somewhere, what happens? Basically, what happens is the other computers on your network recognize that this packet does not belong here. It's destined for another network. So after bouncing around and annoying all the other computers on our network, it's basically shown the door, so to speak. And the TCP IP protocol will say, hey, look, you don't belong on this network. You belong on this other network. Now, we can't really tell you exactly where that network is, but we'll tell you how to get off of this network. And how you get off this network is through the gateway address. Now, usually that gateway address is a router, and it'll handle the rest by forwarding it on to other routers who know where that network is. So basically, a gateway address is just a way off of our network and onto another one. And in the case of a home network, that's usually the home network router, and the other network is the Internet. Once it's on the Internet, then it's up to routers using a system called DNS to help that packet along its way. So we're going to talk about DNS next.